21 cars on the track at the moment. Dwayne Mouget sits in the pit area. The hood is coming up on Mouget's number 39. If he's unable to start, the first alternate will take his place. getting ready to roll in case Dwayne Mouget is unable to get his mount going. ...segment it will be given until the pace lap to enter. Dwayne Mouget was given several pace laps to enter and was unable to get the car fired in time. So number 18, Tom White has moved into the field and the green flag flies. Around the south turn, Jerry Stewart, number four with the lead. Danny Simpkins, 68 in second place. Brian Stuffy Whitford and Steve Heckman battle for third. Stewart and Simpkins pull away a little bit from the rest of the pack. Heckman has settled into third place. Whitford back and forth. complete lap four. Stewart and Simpkins. The passing tub in the back of the bag. First segment winner Bobby Scott has been able to get around only two cars thus far. Now it's three as he picks up Marty Freddy. Stewart continues to lead it. Simpkins right on his bumper, waiting for the slightest mistake. Number two, Steve Eggman is still in third place, but 7X Jim Pettit is on the attack. Stewart and Simpkins run by themselves. About to come up on slower traffic. Eight laps gone. 33 is the distance. The battle for third place really heating up as number 7X, Jim Pettit at a seaside, moves up alongside and then by number two, Steve Eggman. Eggman. Smoke showing at the back of the number two machine as Heckman tries to work down to the pit lane. Heckman still being held outside by some traffic, the 33 car of Cooster. Now, Steve is able to get down. There's a wheel rolling out on the back chute. A wheel on the back chute. Came off of Heckman's car, I presume it may just be one of the center stones. Looks like that what it was, a piece of that foam that's put in the wheel to keep the mud from filling it up. For a minute there it looked like an entire wheel, but fortunately it wasn't, and the race continued. Number four, Jerry Stewart. Being trailed by 
by 68, Danny Simpkins, as they pick their way through the slower traffic. Jim Pettit, trying to stay in contact with the two leaders, but he hasn't been able to catch up with them as yet. That's the 7X car, coming down the front chute and heading into turn one. Stewart, nearing the halfway point as he completes 15 laps. Bobby Large of Watsonville, number 61, running very slowly. Fire under his car out on the back chute as the yellow flag comes out. Every time he tries to re-fire the car, that's exactly what... down in turn four. Looks like 88, Randy Claiborne involved. 38, Marty Proietti. Number 25, Robert Beltran, 39X. Okay, let's see if we can get this second 33 lap segment onto its conclusion. Danny Simpkins, his retirement night in the lead of this second 33 lap segment. And here we go, back to green flag racing. The second place car, number 29, Steve Hendred. Third, number 56, Bobby Scott, who won the first segment. Scott trying to pick up number two. We have cars together down in turns one and two. It's 51X again and 88 again. This time they pick up the 11X car as well. So Eric McWhorter, 51X, 88, Randy Claiborne, and number 11X, Steve Drake. Ready for green, green flag racing, Denny Simpkins, 68, in the lead, number 29, Steve Hendren, second, the 56 car of Bobby Scott in third, and we're under the green flag, Hendren going for the lead, Scott trying to hang on to the two leaders. Here they come, down to the line to complete lap number 17. Danny Simpkins trying to fight off Hendricks. Around the north turns they go. Simpkins continues to hold the lead. Looks under Danny's gray and red blue machine. But Simpkins holds on to the lead. Here comes Hendren again. Hard to the inside. Simpkins fights him off around the north turn. Relentlessly, Hendren tries to get underneath. And Simpkins saves him off. 20 laps complete, 13 remaining. Here comes Scott. And number 59, driven by John Silva. The top four, moving away from the rest of the field. 
as Simkins continues to lead it. Around the south turn, Hendren always down low, looking for a way around. They're coming up on traffic now. Car number six, Chris Stevenson. Simkins goes high around Stevenson. Stevenson moves down low to get the leader's room. The front four gets by and goes on with their race. Coming down to complete lap 23, 10 to go. Danny Simkins looking for what may be the final late model stock main event win of his career as the yellow flag comes out. Number 39X, Tommy Thompson hard into the wall between turns three and four. Thompson really wedged it up there this time. Thompson's crew trying to get him back to his pit area so they can go to work on that right front. And here come the leaders, back to green. Andrews. Drives the outside on Danny Simpkins this time. Can't find any luck there. Goes to the inside again. And Simpkins is able to pull away down the back chute. Around the north turn. Danny Simpkins, 68. Steve Hendricks, 29. 56. Bobby Scott. 59. John Silva. Down the leader. Simpkins starting to pull away a little bit now. In the waning laps of this 33 lap event. 25 complete. Final eight laps. The rear deck lid coming off that 25 car. Still on the point. Hendren second. Scott third. Black flag coming out for 51X. A multitude of problems on the McWhorter machine. this 33 lap second segment of the Don Roberts 99. Scott is in trouble. His mount's blowing. Scott well off the place and losing position. The right rear tire may be the culprit. And Scott heads for the pits. His chance of winning all three segments has just gone away. Bobby Scott, number 56, into the pit area. Danny Simpkins will have two laps to go when he comes across the line. 29, Steve Hendren right on his bumper all the way, but he has yet to get by as Simpkins barrels down the back chute and into the north turn. White flag coming out for Simpkins. Final lap. Into the first turn he goes. Hendren up alongside. Simpkins pulls away down the back chute. Into turn three. Coming up on slower traffic. Down to the checkered flag. Danny Simpkins takes it. Steve Hendren second. John Silva will hold on for third place. In car number 59. So Danny Simpkins won the trophy dash, and now the second of three 33 lap segments.
that race. 